When annotating a profile in previous versions of En-ROADS and annotating the super elevation on the profile, the super elevation annotation was reliant upon the opened IRD file. With open roads, there is no option for an open IRD file within the native En-ROADS product. We have to utilize the super elevation within the corridor modeling in open roads to be able to display the values for our annotation. And we have to have some mechanism in order to bring that information into the annotation within the native En-ROADS. This is going to be done through an XML report for our super elevation. What we have currently loaded is a design file that has a super elevation already generated on this geometry. We have created our super elevation. We have run our super elevation calculations. And now we want to create a super elevation report. So within our corridor modeler task, super elevation report, we want to select our super elevation section that we have previously created. Right select to reset. This generates an XML report for our super elevation data. As you can see in our report, it stores our super elevation lanes that we have created in super elevation, stores our station and our cross slopes and our point type. We want to go ahead and save this XML report as an XML. We're going to call this super elevation. And we're at this point, we are done with our report. For our annotation of our profile, we can create a profile uh, based on any geometry. In this case, our geometry was brought over from our open rows geometry to create our horizontal and vertical alignment. I'm going to create a profile. And now we need to annotate the profile. So to use annotate profile, For our selection, in this instance, we're only going to annotate the super elevation. So under our annotate profile, our general tab, we want to make sure under super elevation report file, we need to browse to that XML report that we've previously created. This is our super elevation.xml. Select open. And as you can see, as we open the file, we now have the option for our super control lines. So we want to select both of our control lines. We want to make sure that our profile set is our current and active profile. When we hit apply, as you can see, now we have super elevation profile lines that are created under our annotation. We can adjust the symbology in our annotate profile, go under super elevation, and we can adjust our objects. This is populated by our section and our super elevation section names. I'm going to change one of the super elevation lines to uh, one color, and I'm going to change the other one just to have a different symbology for each line. And when we hit apply, you'll see that it changes the symbology on the annotation. 